Bah, hey, voilà, mesdames et messieurs, moi, je suis, I am the mysterious Dr. Stereo. This is another episode of Mondo Stereo, the world in three dimensions. And here is my logo. This is the logo, or, or the, the, the name, <laughs> of the mysterious Dr. Stereo, and it is floating into space. And you're asking yourselves, what is he gonna show us today? So, let me explain in the beginning. No, not in the beginning. I'm gonna tell you what day is today. Today is the 24th of December. Is this a special day? Well, yes it is, because that's German Christmas. German Christmas is not on the 25th or 26th, but on the 24th. That's when the Christkind, the, um, the Christ child, comes, or the Nikolaus, the Santa Claus. And I need a Christmas hat to begin with. So let's look what the little elves that are traveling around here got prepared for me. What do you have? Give me a Christmas hat. One, two, three. Good lord, I said a Christmas hat and not those weird goggles. Well, hey, babe, I can't touch everything. My hands are huge, man. Put this away, I need a Christmas hat, please. One, two, three. Oh, well, that's close, I can say. That's very, very close. Now we're getting in the right direction. Christmas hat, is, it doesn't take that much again to bring it to perfection. So, a last try. One, two, <laughs> three. Well, this time you got it. This is a very cool Christmas hat and these are actually my reading goggles. Well, we all don't get any younger, do we? <laughs> so, but what am I gonna show you today? It's a little wooden table I found in the trash bin somewhere and I put beeswax on it and polished it and now it looks very vintage and cool and it's perfect for, for uh, assembling things. But which things do I want to assemble right now? Ooh, what have we here? It's a package in a plastic bag, in a gray plastic bag and it reads can you read it? Can you read it? Russian Post. Posta Rossi. And it comes from Schmidt Roman. Hey, this is so cool to, to have this actually in my hands. It got a, a, a Russian stamp on it and it comes from Moscow. This thing comes from Moscow from Roman Schmidt. Spasiba. Roman for this, but what is it that Roman has sent me? So we're gonna open this right now. Open it very carefully. I'm gonna take some time. Gonna take some time, gonna take some time. On the first day of Christmas the Roman gave to me a gray packaged envelope with something inside. Yes. Yes. And there's something inside. Ooh, it's, it's so cool. It's, it's even now cool and I have not opened it. It reads... Let's pass off. Stereo Photographia. Wow. Stereo Photography. So, wasn't that fun? That's all for today, folks. This was Mondo Stereo. Have a nice day. Ta-da! Hey, man! You didn't open the package! What did I not open the package? You did not! I did! You did not! I did! Oh, uh, <laughs> really, I did not. I was so taken away by this Russian parcel that I could not open it on camera. Please put me back into the seat. Oh man, you're driving me crazy, man! Well, I pay you, so you can get driven crazy as much as I want to. Well, I quit! Can we stop this discussion? <laughs> wow. Uh, yeah, to find good workers today is really a tough thing to do. Let's look inside. 
it's sealed, very good. So I do, and uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I very much enjoy unboxing things. Uh, na, 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 na. On the second day of Christmas, the Roland gave to me, and I forgot to bring a cutter. And I'm alone here, so I have to open it by myself. So here it, here it, it gets open. So, oh Lord, have mercy! So here, yes, yes. So, wow, Erika. I, I call it Erika. Erika is a very cool name. Erika Stereophotografia. Opening a package for the first time is always so much joy. Look here. Retro nude stereo views. 18 pieces. They are so nicely packaged. Oh, and they. <laughs> I have to open it. <laughs> Let's put it here. It's like Christmas. It's the day before Christmas, but it's like Christmas to me. So, what do we have here? We have. Wow, wow. Oh my Roman, th this is just great. These are reproductions of um, vintage stereo cards. And they are so beautiful. I gotta improve my, my Russian reading a lot. So, what's this? What's here? Congratulations! Now you have a stereoscope, an optical device that allows you to watch 3D photos. Eureka is happy to present you the stereoscope, designed and manufactured using the technique of the 19th century. Enjoy watching stereo photos. How to use. Assemble the stereoscope as shown in the image below. To increase the strength of the picture, insert the plastic clip into the handle hole. Plastic clip into the handle hole. Let's see what it's all about. Dooby dooby doo. It looks so beautiful to me. It is so well packaged. Look at this! So we are. Oh, is this beautiful? It's so beautiful. Eureka! You put it this way. Schnurps. That's how it reads. And then, hey, you put it with these thingies outside. Et voila! You got a stereoscope. Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? Look here. <laughs> I'll give it closer to you. So, and now I will carefully. Ah, here is the plastic clip. The plastic clip. To increase the strength of the structure, insert the plastic clip into the handle hole. Handle hole. Handle hole is here. Ah. And so we insert the plastic clip here. Now it's very strength. <laughs> Strong. Eureka! Eureka! And now, now for the tricky part. Who needs the quickie mart? <laughs> Let me take one of these cards that were enclosed. I put it here. And now I have to remove my reading glasses. And I look through the stereoscope for the first time. Wow. So, and here you are adjusting the. Sh oh, wow. Yes. Ah, yeah. For me, it's the last but one to the lenses that makes it absolutely sharp. This really looks good. You're you, it's always the same with a 3D stereoscopy. You're instantaneously sucked into the, the image. It's in 3D. It's no matter how old it is, 
no matter how uh, the, what the motive is, you're sucked into it. You you're there. So let's let's see if I can read this. Ah, Sankt Peterburg, Nevsky Prospect. I can read it. <laughs> I can read it. It's always a pleasure. <laughs> Shall I open the stereo nude retro views? <sighs> I must, but I cannot. I cannot, but yet I must. So I open it very carefully. Very carefully. On the third day of Christmas, the Roman gave to me a package of Vintage stereo nudes. And I don't, I'm not gonna show them to you. I look here and look here and look here. I'm gonna show perhaps one to you. This is, this is the secret. You have to buy this thing yourself. Oh, lady, lady. Hand colored, of course. And with a certain thing. Oh, take, it. whoa, okay. Perhaps I will show this one to you. It's this picture. It's nice, isn't it? Well, what can I say? This viewer looks very, very good. It's very strengthy, stable. It doesn't fall apart. You only have to put away the, the plastic uh, holder here and then you can put it apart again. Chicky, chicky, chick. Yes. It's easy for traveling. You can watch all those beautiful cards that Roman made and you can make yourself cards that fit into this uh, format. These uh, seem to be a little bit smaller than the, uh, the standard cards you're getting, but there are so many formats around that you uh, absolutely will be finding cards that fit into this viewer or you make them by yourself. It's a great opportunity for people to get hooked on stereoscopy Absolutely, it's. I think it's laser cut, the Eureka Stereographia viewer. Oh, why did I put it apart? I don't know. I just wanted to show you how easy it goes. Zack. So we assemble it again. Clack, click. Clack, look. Put the plastic part back in here again. So. Everything's fine now. I can watch the cards. I'm happy with this. Roman, you're a genius. Eureka, I can only say. And spasiba. And to you, my dear viewers and listeners and fans, please uh, do not hesitate to give me a thumbs up or no thumbs down at the YouTube channel. Stay tuned for more information. Ciao and bye bye, Roman.